Are you still figuring out ways to try to get more healthy fats in your diet? Especially healthy fats that you might find from lean, grass-fed meat? Hey guys, I'm Dr. Arlen Hill here with Leah Hill, and we think we've come up with a solution. In fact, we don't think we've just come up with a solution. We think we've come up with a phenomenal solution. So let me share with you what we've had our head wrapped around for a little while here that finally came to fruition of recent. We have what we call the Sweet Ground, and you will see this on our website as the Sweet Blend. It is a play on words, and you might think I'm saying sweet, but it's actually suet. Suet, this is the fat around the kidneys in the animal. Is this not the most gorgeous fat you've ever seen when you've looked at fat? Oh, it is. They call it leaf fat for a reason. It actually literally looks like little leaves in and fat. Yeah, and you probably think I'm nuts saying that it looks gorgeous, but literally, guys, you when you look at the kidneys of the, of the animals, you can see this layer of fat around our animals that is just this thick, rich, yellow fat with all those different flavonoids, those antioxidants is what's given it that color. But the point is, is that this is a rich source of these healthy fats that you often hear about. And when I say that, just to give a little more insight there, we're not only talking about about the omega-3s that most people associate with eating grass-fed and finished beef, but we're also talking about these extremely healthy saturated fats that we're now starting to see more and more benefits from as well. Now, how did we accomplish this? Well, this lady right here was the brainchild, but essentially what we have done with this is we have taken our regular ground beef and we have mixed that suet fat in with the ground beef and so now, do you remember the ratio on those? It is 85-10. It's, uh... No! Is it 85-15? <laughs> I think it's 85-15, guys. So don't quote us on that is the point on that. Green freeze. Yeah, at, at, at a minimum it's 90-10, but I'm pretty sure it's 85-15 on this. But you're going to get those more of those rich fats in this than you would just by eating the ground beef. Now, the ground beef is great, right? We eat it, we love it, but... It's just a little extra little extra and nutrition right it, it's something it's something to give it that special effect like we have the ancestral blend that gives us the the organ component to it this is an additional grind option that's going to give you that nice fat and here's the really cool thing and i'm gonna let leah really delve into this with you fat equals flavor so with that in mind how are we going to cook this leah mm, well there's several different ways you can do it but you know me i'm a little over the top of my cooking so i am going to add two tablespoons of one of my Flavor Wagon spices. I think I'm actually gonna do tonight the grilling and roasting one, and I'm gonna smoke it on the grill. Now, if you don't have a smoker, totally cool. Don't freak out that I can't make that. They're really great made on this stove top. You can put it in your with your favorite marinara for spaghetti. I mean, you can do just anything you would do with regular ground. Yeah, listen guys, L Leah's really into the, the Traeger and the smoking and doing things to, uh, to a high level, right? If Arlen's got to cook dinner, Arlen's going to mix up some, make up some patties here, thaw this out, make up some patties. They're going in the pan on the stove top and we're eating burgers for dinner, baby. That's what we're getting here. And so when you see this, there's... Add some onion and bell pepper. Okay, we'll add some onion and bell pepper on the side, right? Give it, give it a little touch there. But literally, guys, this is, you're going to see if you cook this on the stove top, you're going to see those nice fats in the pan there and once those burgers come off, you're gonna wanna add that fat right back over the top of these burgers and make sure you consume that. Get not only that flavor that you're gonna enjoy, but also be able to get all those good healthy fats that you're eating the grass-fed and finished beef for anyway. And so this is the same, the suey, the leaf fat is the same stuff I make our lotions, body butters, and all that stuff that's coming soon. Um, so I mean, that's just, amazing nutrients and you've probably seen all the literature on that most of you um but it's the same thing but you're taking it internally instead of just an external application yeah and one final thought on this for those of you that are familiar with the concept of tallow but haven't heard of suet all the benefits that you get from eating tallow you're getting that from suet as well it's it's the fat of that grass-fed animal so they're going to be akin to each other we just wanted to add extra to our ground beef and make that an option for you guys so 
Next time you're on the store, scroll through, find this, add a few to your cart. You guys are gonna, you're gonna love it when you try it. Your family's gonna be amazed at the flavor of that ground beef. So until next time guys, Dr. Arlen Hill with Leah Hill out at Harvest Hills Ranch and we will see you guys soon. Cause it's suey. It's suey. <laughs> <laughs> see you guys. Bye guys.